The Power Broker is a biography of Robert Moses written by Robert Caro, who won the Pulitzer Prize in 1974. This book has been named one of the best biographies of the 20th century and has been highly influential on city planners and politicians throughout the United States. Robert Carlo was financially challenged when he wrote this biography. He received little support from friends or publishers. One day in 1971, he came across a magazine article describing the Frederick Lewis Allen Room in the New York Public Library. It said that the only requirement for admission was a contract from a publisher and that its 11 resident writers were allowed to keep books and other research materials at their desks. As soon as he read the article, he applied for the Allen Room and, after a wait of some months, was assigned one of the 11 desks. These writers provided more for him than merely the glow of their names. One day, he looked up and historian James Flexner was standing over him. Flexner asked him, What are you writing about? How long have you been working on it? Five years. When he replied this, Flexner's response was not an incredulous stare. Oh, that's not so long. I've been working on my Washington, the indispensable man for nine years. The next day he was asked the same question by Joe Lash. And Lash, who heard his answer, said, Eleanor and Franklin took me seven years. Hearing these two men, he had wiped away five years of doubt. When you feel that what you're doing is hard and you can't see the end of it, look for someone similar to you. Then you'll probably hear from them about the same experience you're experiencing. It takes a long time for a masterpiece to be made.